is singing. You can feel the passion, the emotion, not just of those clad in yellow and black, but of two and a half thousand Malaga fans, most of whom have spent the day enjoying themselves at Salzgasse Plaza. The rain that's fallen since the afternoon has not dampened spirits here. And Alan, this should be special. It should be. I mean, the opening was special, wasn't it? What an extravaganza they uh, create here, the fans. And I think from Dortmund's point of view, those players, and there are some young ones in there, as talented as they are, they've got to be careful that the fans don't sweep them forward too early, that they don't overcommit. This is Royce, held up initially. Gundogan offside against Lewandowski as the ball went towards him. Well, it's an illustration of how they can cut through you. Some beautiful one-touch passing began by Mario Goodson. Yes, he is off. Lewandowski off the head of Dimikalis. Behind him, luckily for him was Camacho. Sudorman just trying to squeeze the pressure point here. Schmelzer. Here they are in the Champions League and Lewandowski! Well, it was on, wasn't it? He certainly saw the gap behind Willy Caballero. I think he's disappointed with himself. He's backed into his centre half and they didn't defend it well, that long ball. Decent chance for the striker that. Needed a deft touch, couldn't quite provide it. That's found Lewandowski, and Malaga could be in trouble. Lewandowski's gone on the outside, we're showing the outside, and runs out of pitch. Uh, Dean Michaelis did really well actually, uh, anticipated Lewandowski's movement. Really good, solid experience defending there from the Argentine. Uses his strength, gets his body in the path of the striker's run. And there's no getting around him. But they did get caught short, didn't they? With... It's Joaquin! Malaga plant their flag in the ground on Dorman soil! And it's Joaquin! And it's a huge away goal in front of Dorman's yellow wall! Oh, would you believe it? They hadn't threatened at all, had they, last 10, 15 minutes, at all. And there's nothing complicated about the move. Isco's chiefly involved with the layoff. Baptista gets the initial flick on and then feeds off the knockdown. They don't do a good job of defending it. There you go. Through the legs of the defender. Joaquin, one of their danger men coming into this game, and so it has proved. Since it was against Shakhtar. Only Caballero. So he was caught there by Lewandowski. Dean Michaelis makes his move now. Roman Vida, the fella, comes. Not the most convincing, but he's done the job. Lewandowski might get to this. Willy Caballero gets to it instead. Yeah, early on in the match, but important that Malaga don't sink back a little too far onto their goalkeeper. He wants a bit of grass in front of him to make things a bit cleaner when he does come and catch. On for Lewandowski. Beautifully done. Lewandowski. Fabulous. Magical goal for Borussia Dortmund. It doesn't get much better than that. Very sheer class, wasn't it? And the touch for Marco Royce was absolutely sublime. The vision involved, and the weight of pass, set it up beautifully for Lewandowski, who did not look like missing on that occasion. And just what they needed after 10 or 15 minutes when they'd looked uncertain. 
nervous. Dudu's delivery and Roman Weidenfeld are called into action because Borussia Dortmund had gone to sleep at the back and Joaquin almost cashed in again. Well, I don't think you could believe how much room he'd actually got there. Simple near post run and nobody went with. Glorious chance on the stroke of half time there. Tried to feed it into the far corner and he did a bit more power than that. He needed to get those neck muscles behind it. Borussia Dortmund are hoping, Malaga are dreaming right now. This will do for the Spaniards, the semi-final place is there for them. This is Goethe, now Lewandowski! Swallowed up by Willy Cabero. And they do just come at you so quickly when it all falls into place. As it has them on a couple of occasions tonight, not often enough. And it goes on the Portuguese midfield, and round the back was Di Michaelis, and that's a fantastic stop from Weidenfeller, as Borussia Dortmund were caught out again. Well, it's Joaquin yet again, and I think he's gone for the wrong side. I think he should have gone to his left, it's easy to say, isn't it? But that's where the gap was to Weidenfeller's right. It's carried through here to Gutter. It's a wild finish. It's a half decent chance. Sanchez gets caught under the ball. It's a poor attempt at a clearance. Never quite gets set. Mario Goetze. Stretching for it in the end. And now Gamers has gone to the ground after Schmelzer came across it. Well, there seemed to be a stray arm there. From Schmelzer, whether it was just an accidental one, whether the player is making more of it than was there. Kept alive by Goethe. Now Schmelzer. Gern Dogen who covers every blade of grass. Duda to Tulalon! That was travelling and had to be dealt with by Weidenfeller. What a strike that was. Duda! Duda! Oh, he's wanted the ball on his left foot, he wants a corner kick, he's not getting it. I think he should have. I think he came off smelt to that. And with that, it's the end of Duda's night. Something special. And they might get it now! And it's a wonderful save from Caballero, who had no right to keep that out, but he stood big and tall and denied Royce. Well, is it going to be one of those nights? He pulled off several fantastic saves, didn't he, in the first leg? And this is another one. But it is another chance from which Dortmund really should have scored. And Hogan, Goethe wants it back. Goethe! Caballero to the rescue again! And that was just as good with the same leg as well. The left leg making the all-important intervention. He must have thought he'd scored here, Mario Goetze. Malaga are up against it. Alizeu is breaking forward, it's gone to Baptista. This could wrap it up, Alizeu! There's no flag! The goal stands! And Malaga are standing tall amongst giants! The semi-finals of the Champions League could well be beckoning now. Borussia Dortmund have had their hearts ripped out on home soil. Oh, would you believe it? Isco has played an increasingly prominent part in this second half. And he was at the start of it with some really good work. Baptista did well, actually, to just keep the move going on the halfway line. Now from Willy Caballero. There's another one.
Lewandowski. Caught by Sanchez. He made something out of nothing there, Lewandowski. Through sheer desire. It's something now. It's Royce. that they've been at the best during the course of this match whether the occasion has got to them a little bit inhibited a bit nervous Subatic is onside this time Santana is blocked but Borussia Dortmund have one back it's not done yet it's Royce Dortmund ball Dortmund bread and he may just just have given Borussia Dortmund a fighting chance no, we might be speaking too soon here couple of minutes they're queuing up and it's fist across goal Santana they've done it incredible unbelievable astonishing Dortmund dances Borussia Dortmund have somehow turned this around Malaga are down and out on their feet back up the end it wasn't down to still. Schmelz a part of that. This field of grass in the heart of Germany. This is the place where dreams come true. Anything is possible. Borussia Dortmund.